Hello, this is the Trade Tech U.S. Stocks and Futures Market Preview and Domestic Economic Data Roadmap for the week begin. Oh, no, I'm sorry, for Tuesday, the 30th of October, 2018. One more day left in October, so the statements print on Wednesday, but it is not an end of quarter. Here is the ES Front Month Futures contract. This is the daily chart of the broad market futures forum. It was a strange day. We gapped up, we sold off. Let's go through the major daily charts, and then we'll talk about... The economic data coming out for the week ahead or the next couple of days. Uh, crude oil down 16 cents. That was not a big deal. Gold up a buck 70. Also, just a blip. It doesn't really matter. The SP ended up closing it down 17.44. It's a new low close in this move here. Uh, puts us at a six month low and generally speaking, not pretty. Uh, compare it to the close of the year last year, and we are down for the year at this point in time. NASDAQ 100 down 138.50. Still up for the year by a couple of points, although we were lower earlier in, at one point in the day, and it was a negative day. So it's still the lowest close recently. Socks down 12.85. That's not a big deal, except for it's just been a declining index. The biotech's down 34.63. It has got very near the lows of the year at one point in time. Russell 2000 down 6.51. That's not much. Six points on the Russell. But this thing has collapsed 300 points since the high. The trend closes at 1.09. The 10-day moving average 1.10. NASDAQ volume, 2.7 billion shares. It's not as good as most of last week, but it's still a strong day. And again, the down days are higher volume. The up days, less volume. NASDAQ advanced decline, negative 5.52. Some more stocks down than up on the New York, negative 4.47. Google loses $49.02. Apple down $4.06. And it was lower earlier in the day. That's a new four-month low there. Netflix down $14.99. That's a new six-month low. Amazon down 103.93, ugly day for Amazon, and that's a new six-month low. Tesla up $3.95. Tesla has been holding on in all this. TLT, the 20-year bond ETF, down 26 cents. Goldman Sachs up 2.13, but very near the lows. Facebook down 3.28. We still had a good day, made some money on cake, short, EOG short. Rich had some good calls. Um, nothing else to say, really. Let's look at the... Uh, we did the intraday action. Oh, no, we haven't done it. Here it is right here. We've got a five-minute candles, not 10. And here's what it looks like. Gapped up, held up for two hours, started to slide. The NQs filled the gap over lunch, and then we sold off in the afternoon. That's pretty much it. Both sides. Here's the ES, but here's the NQs. Same story. It had filled the gap by lunchtime. You know, it was a negative day. What to say? We gapped up, and it was negative. We are in that mode right now. Again, holding long positions, bottom fishing, looking for to buy stocks. Not smart. Not smart. You want to make money in the markets? Just don't do that right now. Um, all right. In terms of economic data coming out uh, tomorrow, Tuesday, S&P Composite 20, uh, the housing price index, 9 a.m. Eastern, consumer confidence at 10. A lot of data left this week. We've also got the uh, time change next weekend, but that's it so far. So we will trade it, call it as it is. Charts as usual brought to you by eSignal. If you've not yet taken a trial of our services, feel free to do so. We will help you out for a couple weeks. Have a great trading Tuesday.